Welcome to Real Link. This video is going to show you the most straightforward way to stream your IP camera to YouTube. If you're using cameras of other brands, it will help as well, but details may vary. Just follow us. This is what you need. A computer on Windows, Mac, or Linux system. Encoder software, a verified YouTube account, and a network with fast upload speed. And of course, you need to have a security camera. Please note that the Reolink battery-powered cameras, add-on cameras, the Reolink E1, and Loomis don't support this. What you need to do first is to build an RTSP URL, which will be required in the later steps. The RTSP URL contains the camera username and password you created when you initially set up your camera, and the IP address of your camera, which you can find on your Reolink app or client. There are two kinds of URL for two modes of live streaming. One ends with main for delivering high definition live stream, and the other ends with sub for smooth live stream. Choose either one of them according to your camera's resolution. And if you're using a 4K or 12 megapixel camera like the Reolink RLC 810A, you need to change H264 into H265, as these cameras encode videos on H265 compression. Some of you may have an NVR connecting to multiple cameras, so what's great for you is that you can stream any one camera to YouTube, and you just need to change the channel number in the URL. Suppose it's the channel 3 camera on NVR, so we input 03. That's it, and I recommend you copy the URL and paste it in a text or doc file for later use. You can also check this post to build an RTMP URL. The next step Go to YouTube to get the stream key and complete the streaming setup. Log in and make sure your YouTube account has been verified. If not, do the verification now, and you need to wait 24 hours to activate your account. And then click the Create button on the top right corner and come down to Go Live. On this page, click Stream and create a new stream. Enter the title, input the description, and complete the audience settings as required. Change the privacy settings, and you can also choose to schedule the stream. Next, under the Stream Settings tab, copy the stream key and also paste it to the text or doc file. Do not share your stream key with others, in case they may stream from your YouTube account. Then let's move to the encoder part. Actually, YouTube has a list of reliable encoders, and you can just choose any one of them. Here, we'll use the OBS, Open Broadcast Software. Click the Add button under the Sources tab and enter Media Source to create a new video source. Type in a name and make sure the Make Source Visible option is enabled. Click OK, then uncheck the Local File option and paste the RTSP URL we just built into the input field. Click OK and you'll see the camera live feed on the OBS screen. Now we're fairly close to success. The last step is to configure the live stream setting in the encoder. Click Settings in the bottom right corner, and then Stream. Choose YouTube or YouTube Gaming in the Service section, and paste the YouTube Stream key you just obtained into the field. Click OK. Click Start Streaming, and there you go! Now you are streaming your camera live feed to YouTube, and you can go to your YouTube channel to check out if you are on live now. Here are some essential tips for you to stream your camera. The first one is to choose a suitable camera for streaming. Its resolution, night vision capacity, field of view, etc. are what to consider if you want to deliver a high quality live stream. The second is the network. To go live, make sure your network is stable and fast enough. The recommended upload speed for HD live streaming on YouTube is 3 to 5 megabits per second. Lastly, protect your own privacy when streaming. For example, avoid streaming images that may contain your personal information. That's all for streaming your Reolink security camera to YouTube. For more helpful tips, please subscribe to the Reolink channel or click another video to keep watching.